This is an Alan Bradley panel view 800 HMI. The model number is 2711R T40. Its IP address is 192.168.0.100. There can be multiple HMI programs currently installed in it, but only one currently running. To modify something on the current running HMI program, first we need to upload or copy the program from the HMI to the computer. To do it, first connecting the HMI to the computer with an Ethernet CAT5 cable. On the computer, at the bottom left corner, search for control panel. Then open it. Then look for network and sharing center. This is for your local area connection. Click on Ethernet. Go to properties. Double click. Make sure this number match with the HMI except the last number. So if the HMI is 192.168.0.100 on computer, we will have 192.168.0.22. Click OK. OK. And close. Close. To make sure the computer can see the HMI, go to the same bottom left corner, type in CMD, and then ping PING, and then the HMI IP address 192.168.0.22. One hundred zero percent loss, so the connection between computer and HMI is good. Open connected component workbench. Under project, click on discover. This is for your ethernet connection. Expand it. Make sure auto browse eject. This is the HMI that is connected to the computer. Click on it. Then click OK. So there are two HMI programs currently installed in the HMI. The first one is stopped, not active, but the second one is active and currently running. So we want to copy this to the PC. OK. OK. And then under Project Organizer, double click on the HMI. We successfully uploaded the program from the HMI to computer. If we need to modify something in the HMI communication, 
under project organizer double click on the HMI then click on communication this is the current POC IP address that the HMI is communicating to so if the POC IP address has been updated or changed uh, we need to update this in the HMI communication before it can see the POC again after updating the POC IP address we can click on save and then download the updated HMI program back to the HMI and that's it thank you for watching